Uh, Thousand Cuts was his name? Or uh, I don't know. I just switched um, him out. Black Borwin, that's what it was, but Silk Fox. So you can do that in the menu. I completely forgot that. So yeah, we got Silk Fox. I want to hear that you're ready for your next fight. Yes, let's be Code Division. What do you need? I so want many. to give you a shot at the championship. I really do. I need to convince others, though. I'm going to hold an event so huge that it will rock the reaches of the Empire. The Imperial Engagement. The arena turns upon you. Wait, what? You will be one woman against a rushing tide of foes. You must stand against them all, and when you do, your right to challenge the Ravager will be indisputable. Time to take you down a peg. Time to kill I you. I think it's going to be a fun challenge. You might even survive if you pace yourself. Oh, wait, I'm facing all of them. <laughs> Are you ready for me to finish the boss doesn't care. If so, we'll get everyone set up. Let's begin. Excellent. Follow me and we'll get you ready for your next match. Let's do this. The Imperial Engagement begins! And Ogre begins the onslaught! Oh, I'm going through everyone right now. Long sword! Yeah. Hand enters the fray. Double sabers. Double sabers. Long sword. Long sword. Oh, that means I face the soldiers. Shoot. What is the greater foe? Exhaustion or a fiend falling from the heavens? This is going to be a difficult fight if I can't get any focus. Iron Soldier makes another foray against his nemesis. Time? Oh, this is going to be intense. How long can one warrior last battling a tide of foes? What the freaking happened? Shoot! No! 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 Sun Go enters alone. His speed is unmatched. I am a master. The towering strength of Sun Go crashes upon the ring. Okay, I got focus. I can do this. Come on. The master of mysticism is the last to enter this epic confrontation. Get beat. Oh my gosh, that was kind of intense because the elephant demon. The elephant demon is You have like just emerged hard. the victor from a multitudinous <laughs> concretion of raw fighting talent. Amazing! 
Oh my gosh. The crowd loves you. And you have proven yourself enough in my eyes. No other fighter stands a chance against the Ravager. But you must think of your safety. The Ravager strikes with such power that even the wards of this arena may not be enough to save you. Yeah, interesting. I'm Geisha Boss, so... Your match could end in death. It almost happened when Sung Boo faced him alone, and he was the last opponent to tackle the champion alone. The Ravager grows more fierce with each fight, as if time were making him stronger. If you face him, we may not be able to end the match in time. It is that time. This. The Ravager awaits. Do you remember what I told you about fighting him? I'm ready. Excellent. Follow me and we'll get you ready for your next match. So, what happened there was I accidentally clicked off my screen onto another screen, so... Oh, it's that guy who's obviously Black Whirlwind's brother, but is dead. This fight will not happen. This fighter is not worthy of facing a true Imperial Champion. What do you mean? The Ravager will not waste time with one so new to the ring. One must face the test of time to even challenge the Imperial Champion. Why are you scared? Phoenix, Good people, I do this for you. Would you have an unproven whelp as your champion? As the Empire's champion? Get sucked on! Silence! Go fuck You have up. spoken, and I have heard. Your will be done. I give you the Ravager! So far, no damage has been done. Okay, damage has been done. Back up. Heavenly way. Slow him down. Long sword. This is actually kind of. I might actually lose this because he's Heavenly stupid. Wave.
and put me all the way back here. No. There's an Inquisitor. That's what I was going to. Your towards. victories are impossible for the other fighters to ignore. You are a master of the arena, the ground where executioners are born. Perhaps you have potential uh. that you are not even aware of. There may be a role in the executioners for you after all. Maybe. Do you think you stand a chance of joining the Lotus Assassins? Yes. I do. No, you are stronger than that. We will train away this timid front and tap a potential that you haven't yet dreamed of. Right, if you aggressive. survive, you will join an order unlike any other. We enforce the will of Death's Hand and the Emperor. We guard the treasures of the Empire. Mm -hmm. This will be your responsibility. Can you look on silver coins, golden tablets, or prophesized artifacts and think only of duty? Then we will waste no more time. Yeah, I you are asking, and I will allow you to begin training. I don't see any point Proceed lining. Proceed to our fortress. It lies at the far side of the burial ground that is the necropolis, which you may reach through the rich section of the city. Present this token so that they will know you. I expect great things of you. Not many of our recruits possess both the skills to become executioners and the personality to attract such a loyal band of followers. You'll find that I'm not... Oh, okay. Indeed. Many others think that they are above the norm when they join us, as if acceptance elevates their status. You will learn that conformity to our ways will serve you better. I am well aware of those who come with you, their strengths and their weaknesses. You inspire loyalty in most of those who follow you. That will serve you well. Am I? Or do you doubt your own abilities to deal with them if proven treacherous? In time, you will see that your loyalty to our order is all that matters. If you survive your training and remain in control of your senses, perhaps you will serve at my side one day. I never enjoy controlling my senses. They catch a lot of things I'd miss. Whatever. We'd better tell the others we've made some progress. Um, I'm gonna switch out back. I am honored that you have chosen me. Her. And. Screw the arena! I tried my best. It wasn't good enough. They say you're in good with the guild. You're allowed into the back rooms where Sweet Poison Lin runs her shop, aren't you? Uh, I have a favor to ask of you when you have a moment. My name's Gambler Daoshan, by the way. This is I run the straightest name. dice in the Imperial City. I wouldn't want to feed my children with tarnished silver, would I? <laughs> Do you even have children? Good odds and fair play. That's how I keep them coming back. You're not here to play? What did you want to talk to me for, then? You take care of yourself and come back soon to the best game in the city. You asked me if I could go in the back areas. So, what? I, I don't understand. I just don't, actually. Open the door. What's over here? Scrolls. Experience cannibal cookbook. Oh, that's an interesting. They're your cannibals here. That's interesting. I'm 
not much in the way of like wanting to take that guy down, but like, hey, he's strong. He's really strong. I read this right. Yeah. Okay. I didn't finish a mission. And look, that swagger. That swagger. So, things are looking up. You've gained the favor of the Lotus Assassins. Yeah. With the recommendation of the Executioner, the others will welcome you as a recruit. You can slip into the very heart of their lair. I can't agree with this. You don't know what you're getting into. You don't know the danger they represent. And you're retard. Really? What Stupid. did you see while hiding in your swamp? I've observed Death's Hand for years, both in the palace and elsewhere. You could have four faces and a different name and wardrobe for each, and you still wouldn't understand. Death's Hand is not what he seems. Yeah, and you're stupid. Then what, pray tell, is he? I don't know, but his power does not come from study or skill. He is something darker, and we should not be trying to enter his lair. It sounds like Sagacious Zoo wants to go back into hiding. Or perhaps the nursery? Pay no attention, not everyone is as weak as he is. I do what I must because I'm just your boss. They are capable of. The matter is settled. Go sulk in the corner like you're accustomed to doing. I will. This is not helping anything. Are we any closer to getting to the Lotus Assassin so this accursed woman will help us find Master Lee? Oh, she spits fire at last. Now I see how the child left her little village. She has some spirit in her after all. <laughs> but I'm sure you can appease her. You've already gained the recommendation of the Lotus Assassin Executioner. You could also seek out the Inquisitor and gain his recommendation as well, but the path to the Lotus Assassin Fortress is ready for you now. Yeah, she's sorry. And after we find the evidence against Death's Hand, you will take us to the palace to find Master Lee? I promise, little Dawnstar. After we get what I want from the Lotus Assassins, the palace is the first place we will go. You have permission so there won't be any trouble entering. It's only after we have the evidence against Death's Hand that they might notice something is wrong. Yep. You don't want too much fuss. You'll only bring the place down on yourself. Sagacious Zoo has knowledge of the inside. At least he seems to. He's gone. Where... where is he? He's betraying us. Well, you should be more careful of who you trust. That is true. I wouldn't trust any of the ragged homeless you have collected. No offense meant to those of you who are actually homeless, Dawn Star. Oh. If Sagacious Zoo has gone to warn the Lotus Assassins, you need to move quick. If he's just run off, he is no longer our concern. Sure. Zoo would not turn on us. Yes, he would. The Lotus Assassin Fortress is in the far end of the necropolis. They shouldn't give you any trouble. Just appear confident as you enter. I got this. Everything is in place. I'll have my evidence against Death's hand soon enough. Oh, and you'll have access to your Master Lee as well. Yeah. How generous of you. 